There's one more thing to add to finish off this screen, which is to make this confirm order button work. Now again, we're not actually gonna send the order off anywhere, but we are gonna show an alert saying the order went through successfully. Like other things in this form, this does require us to add another piece of local state using at state, to track whether the alert is currently visible or not. And this is where I hope SwiftUI's reactive nature becomes clear. We don't say show the alert now or hide the alert now like we do in UIKit. Instead, we say here are the conditions where the alert should be visible and let SwiftUI figure out when those conditions are met. So first we'll make a new at state property in here to track whether the payment alert is currently being shown or not. So I'll say at state private var showing payment alert is false. Next, we'll attach an alert modifier to our form all the way down here with a simple title, a two-way binding to that property, and some text to show as the alert message on the screen. So I'll say as an alert, saying order confirmed, is presented when showing payment alert is true. Inside this closure, you go ahead and add all the buttons you want. A second trailing closure for the message, which will be text, your total was total price. And we'll just say, thank you, like that. Now this uses a two-way binding for showing payment alert boolean. So that SwiftUI knows to show the alert when that becomes true, but also sets showing payment alert to be false when the alert's dismissed. It reads and writes the value. Now, where I've placed these add buttons here, comment, that's where you can add custom buttons for your alert if you want them. But if you haven't added any, and we've added none here, SwiftUI will automatically add, automatically add a default OK button that dismisses the alert for us. So we can add no buttons here and be perfectly fine. And now we can make the alert show whenever we want just by setting showing payment alert to be true. And so change this confirm order button to be showing a payment alert dot toggle. Flip from false to true like that. And now run the program and see what you think. Go ahead and add full English, order this, go to the order, choose place order and press confirm order. And there we go, the default OK button to dismiss the alert. It's really coming together now.